Coach, your 2014-15 slate of games coming out this afternoon. How are you feeling about the schedule as a whole? I think it poses everything we're looking for in a non-conference schedule. Um, some big opportunities against some of the nation's best, uh, but also some, some regional and local challenges that will uh, prepare us for the uh, upcoming ASUN uh, conference schedule. And talk about that first road trip, Syracuse, Syracuse Cal, back home from Mercer. Then you head off again to, uh, to Fargo, North Dakota. It's, it's going to be a challenge, not only for what happens in between the lines, but also from a travel standpoint. Um, you know, going to Syracuse is an opportunity for us to, to play a, a phenomenal venue, obviously, and against one of the country's best all the time. And then take a quick trip out to California and, and uh, compete against, you know, Kwanzo, Coach Martin, who we knew from Tennessee and everything. But uh, we're looking forward to it. It's going to give us a great litmus test early. And, uh, and then also get, come back here and play the local rival at Mercer. Um, you start off with a bang, and, and hopefully uh, it perpetuates us into a, into a great non-conference where we're working hard to be, pre to be prepared for it. So. And on top of Syracuse and Cal, you also have Illinois and Butler on that schedule. What are you looking for in those type of games? You know, again, an, another opportunity to play against uh, some storied programs with great histories, and, and I think both coaches are looking forward to big years. Um, you know, it's, it's an opportunity, again, to, to be put into a national spotlight. And that's one of the things we're looking to do here at Kennesaw State is give our guys an opportunity to, to play on the national stage. And both Illinois and Butler allows us to do that. And in January, a Sun Conference play kicking off. What are you expecting from the league this year? Uh, again, the league, I believe, is a, a, is a, a league that kind of overvalued or undervalued, overlooked at times. Uh, Florida Gulf Coast, of course, i, I got to imagine is going to be picked to, to win it, and rightfully so with what they've done in the history in the past. Uh, but again, top to bottom, I think this league this year is everyone's going to beat up on everybody. And I think it's going to be as most balanced league it's been um, since in, during my time here at Kennesaw State. And, and I'm looking forward to, uh, to getting in and competing with uh, great coaches and great teams throughout this league.